morning, my special proverbians. <laughs> I'm so glad that you joined me today for a devotion in the Proverbs. Today is Wednesday, March 9th, and we are on Proverbs 31, verses 4 and 5. It is not for kings, O Lemuel, not for kings to drink wine, not for rulers to crave beer, lest they drink and forget what the law decrees and deprive all of the oppressed as their rights. Imagine being oppressed of all your rights. Is it possible that King Lemuel had a problem with alcohol? Imagine someone that you know that has a problem with alcohol. It's painful, isn't it? I'm not talking about an occasional drink, but I'm talking about someone who is wasted regularly, someone who drinks daily, and it is impairing their judgment. As an activity, I was thinking about how we've portrayed alcoholism in our country and how it was portrayed when I was a little girl. I remember every week as a child I just couldn't wait to watch a wholesome show that I absolutely loved. One of the characters was the town drunk. They handled him with humor. And whenever the man had too much to drink, he would walk into the police station, grab the key off of the wall, let him in a set himself in the cell, and sleep off the drunk. It's not funny. People have been having alcohol problems since the beginning of time. I mean, this was written thousands of years ago, and here we have King Lemuel, Lemuel as something not to be, someone not to be, to not act like that. We've always had those role models that teach good behavior, but I do think sometimes the role models can teach bad behavior as well. Teach people not to be like they are because it, it destroys families, it destroys jobs, and in this case, it's destroying a kingdom. As an, as an action, I want you to think about that and maybe even watch a scene or two. Type in to uh, your search engine or get on YouTube and put funny si scenes of drunks and see how funny you really think they are. This is a serious disease. It destroys the body. It destroys the relationships that the person has. It destroys careers. And in our proverb today, it even destroys kingdoms. Do not be a Lemuel. Get help today. Find your local chapter of, of AA. Find a friend that you know has had a problem with alcohol and has not drunk for, for a long time. Has not been drunk for a long time. Get yourself the help you need. Because your family needs you. Your office needs you. And really, everyone around, even people that you don't know, they look at you and they look to you for guidance and just wonder, what do they see? Thank you for joining me today in this serious discussion of King Lemuel. It's not for kings, O Lemuel, not for kings to drink wine, not for rulers to crave beer lest they drink and forget what the law decrees and deprive all of the oppressed of their rights. God's blessings. Have, have some apple juice. You'll enjoy that. Bye-bye.